All right, you guys, today we're going to be paying attention to this sneaky little squirrel. Now, to set the stage, I am currently running the register. I do see him on camera walking through our side lot. So, my first assumption is, oh, local neighborhood kid walking down from his house. So, he's going to make his way towards the front door. He's going to open that door up. He's going to look up at the counter. Dang it, I should have known. And then he's going to make his way down the middle aisle because, obviously, he wants some delicious beverages. Or does he? So, he's going to pull up his pants. He's going to look that way. He's going to look the other way and he's gonna make his way towards the energy drink cooler door he's gonna open that door up and he's gonna look at our delicious selection Ooh, what do they got here I've never seen these before uptime energy drinks hmm they got black ones with sugar white ones without sugar I kind of want some sugar let's go with a peach lemonade and let's try a sugar-free one as well let's see which one I like better hmm do I want sweet summer melon raspberry lemon citrus peach lemonade mango pineapple maybe blueberry pomegranate uh, let's just go with the original sugar-free citrus yeah that sounds good so he's going to make his way towards the counter to pay for them obviously freeze customer appreciation time this is Jeremy he's probably the nicest guy you'll ever meet he's also the number one Kia salesman in the world so if you want to buy a new car, you should definitely go talk to Jeremy, because trust me, he wants to see you in a Ken Ganley Kia. Now, back to this guy. So he's going to force me to end my conversation with Jeremy. No, 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 no way. For sure not. Later, brother. I'll talk to you. Q, is that it? Yeah, these going to be seven. Oh, okay. So I make my way into the office to run the bills through the money counter, and that's when he decides, yep, not waiting around for those results. So he leaves the beverages, makes his way out the door, and instantly starts running. I hear the door buzzer, so I'm like, oh no, I gotta run too. So I book it out the door, and I start chasing him down. Come on, Brandon, get him, get him, you gotta get that $46 back. So I go running up the snow mounds like a boss. Then I make it through the snow, past the trees, and then I hit this snow mound. Then I eat shit. Then I look up, and he's peeling off in his Hyundai Sonata. Then I come running down here, and I see Jeremy, and I'm like, Jeremy, get his license plate number, please! But his window was up, so he had no clue what the heck I was shouting at him. So he rolls his window down, I tell him that I just got shafted out of $46, and then I do the unfortunate jog of shame back into the store. Now these are the best counterfeits we've ever gotten. As you can see that 50 in the corner reflex just like a normal 50 would. You hold it up to the light, you'll see that USA 50 strip down the middle and the face popping through. That seems legit. And then where I scratched was right here. They did something to the paper to give it a texture just like a real $50 bill would have. Now, sometimes those pens will not work because they could have bleached a real bill. So, if you don't have a machine that tells you it's real, like that one's real. Now, let's put a counterfeit one in there. Oh, beeps and tells you, yep, that's counterfeit. So, the best thing to do is, is to scratch every surface you can on the face of the bill because this jacket should have texture on both sides. This seal should have texture. This seal should have texture. This border all around should have texture. And these do not have any texture. Super smooth. But if you do it to a normal $50 bill, you'll feel it on every one of those spots that I mentioned. You can tell that there is something there. If you can identify this fake bill passer, please send us a message on any social media platform. The Secret Service would like to have a chat with him. He was driving what I believe was a silver Hyundai Sonata, and he came from the Summit County direction. 